All right, family, welcome back to I Love Me, Me, Me. So during Vlogmas, I answered the question of what are eight things guys wish girls knew? So now I'm going to answer what are eight things that girls wish guys do. So stay tuned. Hey, family, so the first thing that girls wish guys knew is that just because she slept with you on the first date, don't mean that she sleep with every guy on the first date. Yeah. Just hitting y'all with it right out the gate. <laughs> Just because she did it with you, bruh, does not mean that she does it with every guy that she meets. Now, I know that that's hard to believe, but maybe you really do have the juju that got her juices flowing to say, you know what, let me go ahead and do it with this dude. But trust and believe, every guy do not get the same treatment. The second thing that girls wish guys knew, this one actually has been out there, but I want to put it here anyway, is that if, bruh, bruh, come on in, come on in, bruh, if you help out with chores around the house, we could be having so much more sex because I'm tired just like you. I worked all day just like you, bruh. I'm rearing the kids. I'm coming home to feed everybody. I'm making sure everybody fed. I'm tired. So by the time the sex thing is about to come into play, man, I just want to sleep. <laughs> so if you helped out more around the house with the domestic duties, including the children, giving them bathed and the homework and all of that other stuff that life entails on a day-to-day -day basis, trust me, you'll get some more sex. Just help out some more. The third thing that girls wish guys knew is that we know that it is now 2018. We usually can pay for ourselves on a date. So just know that we don't always want or expect you to pay for us. The fourth thing is that the little things mean the most to us. Everybody thinks that relationships are about the huge things, but really they're not. They're about, you know what, you know that I like coffee in the morning and you took the time to make some coffee in the morning. You know what? I know that you love the way that I fix this particular um, food, whether it's breakfast, lunch, or dinner. So let me make sure that I go ahead and fix that for you. You know what? I love the fact that you actually do do all of the laundry, fold it up, and put it away. I love that about you. I love that you actually take out the trash. It, the relationship really is built upon the little things that actually happen every single day. Bro, number five is especially for you. Listen up. No girl ever wants to remain the friends with benefits, even if those words have the audacity to roll off of her tongue when y'all first meet. Trust and believe she's not going to want to be nor stay in the friends with benefits zone. Number six, since we're on the topic of sex, just know that girls like sex just as much as men do. We do. We might not talk about it as much as you. Trust and believe when we're with our group of girlfriends, sex comes up just like relationship comes up. Maybe not. Maybe they're not equal, but my point is they definitely come up often. The topic of sex comes up often. We want to have sex just like you want to have sex. We just hold back. We're able to control ourselves a lot more. But we be thinking about, dang, it's been months, it's been years. We, we be thinking about the same thing. We want it just as much as you do. The seventh thing that we ladies want you guys to understand and know is that when you do share your feelings slash emotions with us, you make us feel closer to you. You make us feel like we are a part of this with you. You make us feel like we are on the same team. You make us feel like we, you actually trust us with your sensitive information. We're building closer bonds when you open up and share your feelings with us. And it not only being a one-way street. We want you to understand and know that. The eighth and final reason, my brother... <laughs> Girls wish the guys knew that we just like to cuddle for no reason at all. 
and we love it when you just want to cuddle for no reason at all. There's no ulterior motive. There's nothing thrown in there. Again, this is part of that little things that make the relationship go round. The cuddling is a portion of it, and we absolutely love it when you decide to take it upon yourself to start it, to initiate the cuddling process. We love it when you do that with us. All right, bro, I hope that this has actually helped you out. Give me thumbs up. If, if any of these things that you have thought of, but you have yet to take action on, start taking action on them today. Absolutely start taking action on them today. Is there something new that you didn't necessarily know about or you didn't think it was as important as me uh, making mention of it today? Leave me a comment down in the comment section below. You guys know that I love to read you guys' comments because it is my journey but it's also your journey by being my subscriber as well uh definitely give me thumbs up if you like this video and of course subscribe to the channel if this is your very first time here because here at i love me 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 i am supplying you guys with the tips and tools in order to have happy healthy romantic relationships all right i will see you guys soon Mwah.